hello guys and welcome to a new video in this video i'm going to show you how to make a backup for your unity project without having to copy and paste your whole project over and over so to do this let's go to unity hub let's choose the project that i want to make a backup for example let's choose the drag and shoot click on these three points on the right click show on explorer here it will open the path for the project let's enter this project select the asset and project settings and copy these two folders that's the only two folders you have to copy the whole thing unity will generate all of these uh, uh, folders now let's go to another hard drive i always recommend you to back up your projects in another hard drive so if like i keep my unity projects in ssd if my ssd dead i have my backup in another drive here let's create another folder let's call it like drag and shoot backups click on this folder and let's create another folder let's call it backup with the date of the day I, I don't know what today is uh, it's the 6th of January happy new year by the way it is 2022 now enter this project and pass your two folders here the asset and project settings that's all what you have to do now we have a backup in another hard drive and as you can see it's instant and fast now let's say i want to load this backup and like i want to use this project again what you have to do is just like copy these two backup folders go to your unity project direction i think it's uh, in my ssd yeah here let's create a folder here I will call it uh, like drag and shoot for example let's enter this project and let's pass my two backup folders now let's go to unity hub click on add choose that folder that we just created select it as you can see it will pop up here in unity hub let's enter this project to see if it will it works Let's wait it to load unity here will generate all the missing folders as you can see it was only the asset and project settings but it generate the library the log the packages the thumb and the user settings and everything will be saved with no problems even the settings everything will be saved the only thing that sometimes you have to add it manually is the some packages that you add from the top bar or uh, the post processing package sometimes it just doesn't uh load them uh, the only thing thing you have to do is just go to window and package manager and add these missing folders you will see errors here in console sometimes you will see errors here on console just look what project is missing and add it just from the package manager as you can see here our project is working fine it will not load the main scene so let's go to scene and load the scene that was on my project so this is the end of the video guys and always remember back up your projects it will save your life just back up your projects always every time you you have or you want to add something new to your project sometimes it will just like mess everything just back up your project before you do it let's for example i want to add unity ads to my projects or any other sdk before you do this always back up your project as you can see if you go here to my game i'm working on i make a lot of backups there is a backup before i add playfab backup before i add google and facebook this is some random backups backup before i structure my project again thank you for watching see you next video